Well, hello, it's your old mate Dave Spencer back with you once again. And today we're down in Limerick and uh, a, a city I know well. I was four years in the county of Limerick working here in the 1970s to 1980s. So familiar territory, but of course a lot of things do change. Haven't seen any new buses here. I think they might have had some new uh, coaches, but they the bus station uh, for the coaches or coach station is up by the railway station not in the city centre anyway it's great to have you here it's the beginning of September 2021 Ireland like England still enduring restrictions from the corona pandemic although uh, a lot of their remaining restrictions are starting to be eased and uh, over the uh, coming weeks and into October most most of the restrictions should be uh, lifted and uh, anyway it's great we're here and uh, it's lovely to have you along with us what are we going to see in Limerick oh, oh, wait for it we shall see what we shall see as ever was the case and uh, I'll crack on and uh, perhaps have a word along the way or catch up with you at the end how's that I'll get going bye for now Actually uh, got two buses in sight, three actually. Let's hope we do better than uh, I did at first uh, try. Lights a bit uh, tricky at the moment. It was it's fairly uh, bright light earlier. It's uh, he doesn't know what to do now. <laughs> anyway, with a bit of luck we'll get a still shot of him as well. Well, he's heading in the right direction. Cavanas. Whatever, whatever, we'll get a shot. Yeah, it's the bendy bus. We'll get something of a shot. Dublin coach. So they're running uh, both single deckers and bendies.
Well, hello, it's your old mate Dave Spencer back with you again. I hope you enjoyed your visit to Limerick. We're now in Waterford and it's Friday afternoon, early September 2021, and Ireland, like England, in the throes of the corona pandemic, just gradually starting to wind down their restrictions through the rest of September and into October. Anyway, I'm not going to chat too much because we've got a job to do and not much time to do it. We'll go up near the uh, bus air and uh, bus station and uh, there are a lot, like there are in most places in Ireland, of independent services on these days and uh, hopefully we'll pick those up as we go. So I'll see you all later on. How's that? Bye for now. I couldn't manage a near side or offside shot of that because uh, there were too many cars in the way. It really is a frustrating place for photography. Not quite on uh, on par with Limerick. That really is really really difficult. There's a gap. Yes, do our best with the gap. Mind the gap. Mind the pedestrian. I haven't forgotten to turn off, uh, it's one of the uh, local buses on his way there, somewhere be in front of uh, fairway coaches. I don't know who the little white job here belongs to. Is he of interest? Wow, rabbies. There we go. Really clogging up now. Oh, the action just sort of sneaks up on you.
Well, it's your old mate Dave Spencer back with you again. And time to bid you farewell from Waterford in the southeast of the Republic of Ireland on this Friday afternoon. And we'll do battle now to uh, bash through the rush hour traffic back along the coast to Cork. And uh, we've uh, got some uh, trucks to film at the beginning of next week. And then we're going to be up in Dublin looking out for more of the tendered services. So lots more to go. But for the moment, it's bye for now. Stay safe, stay well, God willing. We're all going to meet up again in the very near future for another one of our transport adventures. So uh, fingers crossed. And uh, <coughs> gosh, I'm going to sound like Vera Lynn, but we will meet again, eh? Yeah, and perhaps this wretched corona pandemic will be finished one day as well. Anyway, for now, from me, bye bye.